Hi guys. How come Marsha's looking darker than I am now? <laughs> She's looking more mm. tan than I am. We're a different type of tan. Mm -hmm. But we are getting ready. We've all packed. We're all ready to go. We've done the chores. Thanks to Masha for doing the last minute chores this morning. <laughs> we're heading to Fiji, guys. We got our flight booked. I'm like getting hyper. So we're just going to go. We're about two and a half hours early before our flight leaves. How exciting. We're about to go to Fiji. Uh -huh. Woohoo. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go catch this flight. Hi guys, so we made it through security. It was like quick and great with grace and ease. And I'm just sitting here debating to get a coffee. It's a major lineup, but I'm so excited. And I just really wanna let you know all that I'm so grateful to be going to Fiji. It really was the smoothest border patrol, the smoothest security. It was so good. I'm so thankful for that because we thought it would take extra long with COVID, but it was fine. We're at the gate in this part of Wellington International. Love this side of the airport. Ooh. Earth plane. <laughs> We're right there. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a window. <laughs> oh. What happened? We made it. What happened to my window? <laughs> she wanted a window. <laughs> actually got into our hotel finally we had a lot of administration and when we first landed we were in the customs line for like an hour and it was really long wait but we made it through and then we got a shuttle which we pre-booked to the hotel we're staying at the Ramada I'll give you a room tour in a second but when we arrived to check in we realized that we need to take the mandatory rat test unfortunately they only are on site at 10 a.m. and we leave tomorrow around like 7 30 in the morning or so Oh, that was a concierge with our luggage. Gave us our luggage for us. Yeah, we found out we have to now take a taxi to the medical center because they don't do the rats here. So we have to go there to them at an additional expense to get ourselves there. But what can you do? We're leaving tomorrow. We need to take a rat test within 72 hours, but we just don't think we could take it on Yasawa Island. So we got to do it tonight. So we're dropping our bags, taking a taxi, heading back into town, get our rat tests done. Hopefully it's a negative result. 
result and then we'll come back to the hotel so i'll do a very quick room tour and then we gotta go <laughs> but like first impressions love the weather love the people super friendly so far and all our interactions with all the people that we've come into contact with even like the airport driver the hotel concierge yes, the hotel yes. reception everybody was really sweet so really really grateful and blessed to be here feeling really thankful tonight but let's do a quick room tour it looks like we have a whole suite to ourselves for one night we're only here one night so we start off with an actual washer and dryer combo that's cool <laughs> Microwave, little kitchenette here with a cooktop even. There's Masha at our table, the couch, little desk area. Thank God we got AC, TV, and I'm assuming the bedroom. Oh, this is nice. Oh, thank God there's an AC in here too. Look at this cute closet. Oh my gosh. That's cute. A safe. Loving this big bed. I think that's a king size bed for sure. We even got a TV in the bed. We got our ensuite. Ooh, okay, Ramada, come through with the free toiletries. Oh, even beach towels. It's too late to go swimming. I don't know if we'll even use that. All right, so what's this room then? Oh, another bathroom. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, they gave us a huge suite. There's two more beds. Okay, well, I reckon Masha and I will just share the king bed, to be honest with you. We got two bathrooms. Okay, so we made it. And then one, one thing Kara forgot to mention was apparently, because I'm from Canada, from Treaty 4 territory, this country is only open to New Zealanders and Australiers, Australians. And so thank goodness I've been in New Zealand for 31 days because that was the cutoff. Otherwise, I would have had to turn around and give my arse back to Wellington. I got in. And so, yeah. Yeah, there was like a mini drama. Mama almost got deported. <laughs> <laughs> Mama no, almost they arrived say, to Fiji. Get, and get that, that Nietzsche girl out of here. Yeah, I got kicked out. <laughs> But we avoided it. Thank goodness it all ended up this way because we really didn't know that that was what it was. We didn't know the rule. And Kara's now a man, Mr. Kara. We have a little typo there yeah. with the Mr. Bula. Bula, bula. Okay, we gotta go though, okay. for real, for real. Okay, can we go out? We forgot to go on the patio. We have our own patio. Not much of a view that way, but over this way Hi. is the ocean. Nice. Kind of hard to see, but it's behind the palm tree. We missed the sunset. We were too busy dealing with all the admin, admin that we had to sign a lot of forms and stuff. But how cute is this? We're gonna have dinner by the beach tonight. I know, but it will be dark by the time we get there. <laughs> Good. <laughs> the clinic. Hi guys, so you know, with COVID, we have to come and get a rat test and we had to get one upon our arrival. And of course the hotel, we booked it online for 6.30, but then when we got to the hotel, they said that we had to come to this clinic. So now we have our cat, our drivers waiting for us and we're waiting in line. And thank goodness we paid it online because they don't take cash here. It's just, you know, the COVID times. It's very different, you know, but it's a beautiful country. Beautiful. the most of it yeah i'm just gonna keep attitude high positive. Like, so positive and you know what i'm so happy to be here yeah. well we're back at the hotel and we are both negative yeah. yeah now we can live it up in fiji enjoy our holiday now we had to do all of that administration thank you covid <laughs> but it's okay we're negative we can enjoy our holiday unfortunately that little detour did mean that we missed the sunset but we're gonna go to the hotel restaurant and have dinner tomorrow we have a very early start we have a pickup picking us up around 7 38 a.m and we have a ferry booked it's taking us to yasawa island which is beautiful island most people that we tell here that we're going there they just say it's beautiful lots to do beautiful beaches white sand so we're just very grateful that everything worked out we had a taxi take us there he waited for us while we waited for the results the taxi took us back and just dropped us off i'm feeling a bit sleepy now the travel and everything has caught up to me literally though this is my first international trip in just about three years so i'm not used to this catching flights anymore and the immigration and all of that but i'm really really grateful 
grateful that most things went very smoothly today and the little hiccups that we experienced we were able to problem solve and take care of it without much fuss. Both mom and I feel very comfortable in Fiji. It's just a very relaxed atmosphere, friendly people. Everybody says hi to you, you know, they're curious about us and they're happy to have us here in their home island. So let's go for dinner because we've worked up an appetite. Oh, also the weather, perfect. Love the weather here. Not too hot, not too humid, warm, beautiful, tropical. I'm so happy. dinner it's shipwreck i think it's yeah, called ship, shipwreck fire and grill cheers, cheers. to pg Whoa. Hey oh, <laughs> like round one we've got a basket of garlic bread we've got a lot of food coming Sausage. It's from New Zealand. <laughs> Sausage. We got the fish and chips. This smells delicious, by the way. You're gonna really enjoy that. I've gotten round one, no, round two. Still have some garlic bread for the pasta. But this is a margarita pizza, guys. It looks banging. And here we go, the chicken mushroom pasta. The final round. So much carbs, but I'm loving it. <laughs> 